Welcome back to the Plant-Based Kidney Doctors YouTube channel. In this new video series, we will bust some common myths about carbohydrates. If you are searching for diet or fitness information on YouTube, you have undoubtedly heard all kinds of advice on carbs. Everything from avoiding them completely, to carb loading to how many grams you should, or shouldn't consume. Today's myth? I am cutting back on all my carbs to lose weight. Culinary medicine is the heart of the reversing medical disease program. We customize whole plant-based food diet plans for people that are dealing with stage 2 through 4 chronic kidney disease caused by type 2 diabetes, kidney stones, and or hypertension. We also customize exercise plans for obesity, hypertension, and diabetes. Don't hesitate to visit our website for more information. What are carbohydrates? Mostly referred to as sugars. But as you will see, there are many types of sugars or more correctly, carbohydrates. I am cutting back on all my carbs to lose weight. We often hear this with patients following a keto or no carb diet. This is a myth. The chemical makeup of carbohydrates is literally in the name. Carbon and hydrogen. But there is also an oxygen molecule as well. Carbohydrates are broken down into four classes. These are based on how many sugar molecules are bound together by the hydroxide molecule. Disaccharides, oligosaccharides, polysaccharides, monosaccharides. We will first talk about glucose, a monosaccharide, and learn if it is indeed the cause of obesity. Mono means one. So one carbohydrate unit like glucose, fructose, or galactose. Glucose is the most common sugar, we hear about. However, the word, sugar, is often used improperly, to refer to all types of carbohydrates. Therefore we want you to use this word correctly. We will specify the type of carbohydrate we are referring to, in the RMD clinic, the glucose molecule has six carbons. And it comes from 1. Your diet. Pound for pound, plants have a larger carbohydrate source than meat. 2. From glycogen found in our muscle or liver. These organs convert excess glucose to glycogen, to save for fuel later. And number 3. Gluconeogenesis. Gluconeogenesis is the breakdown of glycogen from excess proteins and fats that are stored in adipose and liver tissue. Other monosaccharides include, fructose. Fructose is the sugar in fruits and some vegetables. Only the liver, kidneys, and intestine can metabolize fructose. Most human tissues cannot even use fructose. Galactose. Galactose is found in artichokes, mushrooms, dates, papayas, bell pepper, tomato, and watermelon. Galactose is mostly metabolized by the liver and red blood cells. So what is wrong with myth one? I am cutting back on all my carbs to lose weight. Using the word carbohydrate incorrectly. Refined sugars are the ones we need to avoid. Refined sugars are manufactured to be used as sweeteners or flavoring in many food products, usually in abnormally large amounts. They are used in foods and beverages such as soda, condiments, and cereals. Not to mention this refined sugar is devoid of other nutrients. Refined sugar is used in crackers that already contain an excessive amount of salt and fat. All this excess can cause your pancreas to burn out over time from producing so much insulin. We all need carbohydrates because when we consume carbohydrates from whole plant-based foods, they are broken down by our body into glucose. And most importantly, glucose is the number one fuel that our brain uses for energy. Therefore, there's no such thing as bad glucose or good glucose. In fact, glucose is utilized by all tissues in our body. Here's a fun fact. Our red blood cells rely on glucose for ATP synthesis, or energy formation, via glycolysis, since our red blood cells lack mitochondria. One other point. It is very difficult to avoid carbohydrates. Fruits and vegetables are made up of carbohydrates. In addition, if you manage to avoid all carbohydrates, you are placing yourself at high risk for deficiencies. In micronutrients such as selenium and magnesium, or deficiencies in vitamin C and B complex vitamins. Not to mention a no carb diet will have you feeling like crap, with brain fog and feeling hangry. Hungry, plus angry. 
listen to my flow. It is about your life. Words for your children, husband or wife. That high blood pressure for many, many years because you felt no pain. Well, it's dialysis time, my dear. That's your